Today, we'll be upgrading the infotainment system on a Mercedes ML. First, we remove the air conditioning control panel. Then, remove this silver trim frame. Next, unscrew these two screws. Pull the head unit halfway out, disconnect the side plugs. Now, fully remove the head unit and disconnect the power plug on the back. Next, unscrew the two screws holding the air vents. Use a flathead screwdriver to release the metal clips on the sides of the vents. Remove the air vents. Now, you can take out the air vents. Next, unscrew the two screws holding the original screen. Remove the screen. Disconnect the LVDS and power plugs on the back. The removal is complete. This is what it looks like. Now, install the metal bracket. Secure it with one screw on each side. Find the head unit power plug. Remove the fiber optic plug. Insert the fiber optic plug into the new power connector. Connect the new power connector to the head unit and the original power plug. Connect the new power plug to the original head unit. Now, run the white screen power plug to the metal bracket. Insert the O adapter cable into the O port in the armrest. Connect the AUX output from the new power to the O adapter cable. This will ensure the new head unit output sound properly. Connect the original LVDS plug to an adapter cable. Install the new air vent panel. Secure it with four screws. Fasten it properly. Now, connect the LVDS adapter cable and the white power plug to the new head unit. Align the clips on the back of the new head unit. With the slots on the air vent panel, install the new head unit. Reinstall the air conditioning control panel. Reconnect the side plugs to the head unit. Reinstall the head unit. Finally, reinstall the silver trim frame. And we're done. We just connected the AUX adapter. Now, we need to switch the audio output. Enter the original system. Select audio. Select AUX. Long press the screen to return to the Android system. Now, let's quickly demonstrate some features. It supports local maps. You can also download other online map apps. It syncs real-time original air conditioning information. Supports Bluetooth music. Supports wireless CarPlay. Android Auto and Huawei Hicker. You can use the voice assistant to make calls. Listen to music. Use online maps and other mobile apps. Supports original car reversing. Rear view can be added if not available. That's it for this video. We have more videos on other car models on our homepage. Feel free to check them out.